Donald Trump, shocking excerpts from Mary Trump's book on her uncle. Revealed notes written by President Donald Trump's niece say he is narcissistic and that he now threatens the lives of all Americans. Mary Trump's book describes, too much without being satisfied, how my family created the most dangerous man in the world. Uncle is a fraudster and a bully, according to what the BBC reported. The White House rejected the allegations contained in the book, from which extracts were leaked to the American press. The Trump family filed a lawsuit to stop publishing the book on July 14. More than narcissism. There is absolutely nothing to satisfy her uncle, 55-year-old Mary says, and the US president has all the characteristics of a narcissist. The situation here outweighs the known narcissism, wrote Mary, who has a PhD in clinical psychology. And Donald is not simply a weak personality, but his arrogance by himself is fragile, and therefore must be supported every time, because he knows inside him that he has nothing of what he claims. She says that the president was affected by his father's control, singled out Trump's father, while his father was bullied, and Trump's son, who died from alcohol-related diseases, died when Mary was 16. Mary says her grandfather was very cruel to his older son, because he wanted him to take over the family business after him. But her father distanced himself from family companies, and the grandfather had no other choice but to turn to his second son, Donald. This was not a pleasant option, according to Mary. When business turned to the south of the country in the late 1980s, the father's individual could not get rid of his son's terrible incompetence, and he had no choice but to continue investing, she wrote about Trump's father's direction toward his younger son, the future US president, 45. He unleashed the monster. The White House rejected the claim that Trump's father was rude, and cruel, saying that the president describes his relationship with his father as being intimate, and says that his father was very good with him. I should have brought down Donald. In her book, Mary Trump describes how she provided Trump tax documents for the New York Times, which published an investigation of 14,000 words on Trump's questionable tax plans during the 1990s, including examples of apparent fraud, which increased the wealth he inherited from his parents. Mary said that journalists took refuge in her and visited her home in 2017, and that she was first hesitant to help them. She waited a month, watching Donald broke the standards, put alliances at risk, and stepped on the weak, before deciding to contact the New York Times editors. After smuggling 19 boxes of documents from the legal company in which they were kept, I handed them over to the editors. Mary describes how she embraced them at the time, and how she described that moment as the happiest moment I felt in months. It wasn't enough for me to volunteer for an organization to help Syrian refugees. But I had to drop Donald. Cheater the University Mary Trump claims that her uncle paid money to a friend to attend the SAT test instead, a test that US universities use to decide students' eligibility for admission, because he was concerned that his low average score, which does not place him at the front of the class, might prevent his efforts to obtain on admission. And he hired a smart boy, who was known for taking tests easily, to enter the SAT test instead, she says. Donald, who has never been unable to finance, paid his colleague generously, she added. Trump enrolled at Fordham University in New York City, but later turned to the Wharton Institute of Business at the University of Pennsylvania. The White House denied that the president had cheated on the university acceptance test. Donald ruined her father. Mary blames the father in the Trump family, and Trump the father replied, for most of the defect that he claims to be in the family. She says that Trump Trump, who was a real estate tycoon in New York City, destroyed Donald Trump, the younger son, by interfering with his ability to develop and experiment with full human emotions. She says, an individual misunderstood his son's understanding of the world, and harmed his ability to live in it, by preventing him from reaching his own feelings, expressing them, and stigmatizing many of them as unacceptable. Soft was not acceptable, she says, according to Trump's father, adding that he was fomenting anger when her father, 
who was known as Freddy, apologized for any wrongdoing. She said that the father was making fun of his son. He wanted his oldest son to be a killer. She added that Donald Trump, who was seven years younger than her father, had plenty of time to learn, from observing his father insulting his older son. She said, the lesson learned was simple, which is that it is wrong to be like Freddy, so Trump did not respect his eldest son, and so did Donald. His problem with women. Mary Trump says that her uncle asked her to write a book about him without mentioning her name, under the title The Art of Return, and gave her an unjust summary of the women who expected to date them, but after they refused him, they suddenly became worse, uglier, and more obese. However, after a period of expulsion, she hired another person, and she did not pay her anything for her work, she says. She says that Trump in some of his comments hinted to her body when she was 29, although she is his niece, and that he was married to his second wife, Marla Maples. She says that Trump told his current wife, Melania, that his niece left the university and take drugs when he hired her for the book project, and it is true that she left college, but she says that she never used drugs, and that she believes her uncle made the story up to say that he was her savior. The story was for Trump, and he may have believed the version of events according to his version of it, she added. Who is Mary Trump? Mary Trump, 55, is the daughter of Fred Trump Jr., the elder brother of the president, who died in 1981, at the age of 42. Her father suffered from alcohol addiction most of his life, and his unexpected death after a heart attack was attributed to drinking alcohol. President Trump spoke of his brother's personal problems as he urged his administration to push for opium addiction treatment. Trump said in an interview last year with The Washington Post that he regretted pressuring his older brother to join the family's real estate business. Mary Trump shunned the limelight after her uncle assumed the presidency, and after being a critic of him in the past. After Trump won the 2016 election, she described what she felt like, it was the worst night of my life, according to the Washington Post. We will be judged harshly, she wrote on Twitter. I am sad for our country.